The Prime Minister promised to make life more affordable for Canadians when he took office, but after eight years of this Liberal government, rent has doubled, mortgage payments have skyrocketed, and housing prices have doubled as well. Just in today, we found out that housing construction rates are actually down by 14 per cent concerning investment. Only this Liberal government would use a housing accelerator fund to decelerate housing. <laughs> Contrary to Liberal belief, photo ops don't build houses. I know, this is news. So when will the housing minister stop the photo ops and actually get some work done? Yeah. The Honourable... The Honourable Minister for Housing, Infrastructure and Communities. Uh, Mr. Speaker, if the Honourable Member has concerns about the use of photo ops, I'd suggest she discuss with her leader why he shows up at projects that he had nothing to do with to take a photo and then uses homelessness uh, as a political prop for his social media. Mr. Speaker, exactly. the reality is that member knows that we have a plan to build more homes. It's to cut taxes and to put money on the table for home building. They want to raise taxes and cut that money for home building. Mr. Speaker, I was in the Honourable Member's uh, province just last week announcing a $228 million agreement that's going to see the City of Calgary add more than 35,000 homes over the next 10 years. We're going to continue to do the work that's necessary to get The Honourable Member from Lethbridge. What the Honourable Member knows is this. Rent prices have doubled, house prices have doubled, mortgage rates have skyrocketed, and investment in housing construction is down 14 per cent. This minister just isn't getting the job done, despite his promises to Canadians. So when will he stop the photo ops and actually get to work so that Canadians can have a roof over their head? Yeah, yeah, yeah.